Hello, it's Arius Reloaded, and here I have another Footman vs. Quartz replay or gameplay. And this will be my first commentary, and I hope you enjoy my very stupid sounding voice, as I really do sound like a menti mentally ill child. But that can't be helped, since I am very cheap. Yes, I am. And here's a for my first grunts uh, about this game. A little lag there. Um, we, I believe we totally rape the other team. They put up a nice, good fight, but in the end, it was not a good idea for them. And here I'm going to go ban. I'm um, uh, actually an undead slayer in the game. But it's actually a uh, unit itself is abandoned, but it's a hero, so a custom hero. And I first get slam, cause slam is just pawnage to I units. And in this gameplay, I'm gonna go hero, uh, a little close up there, back up. And yes, uh, my teammates, I think. Um, I think they're pretty good, actually. I believe they were very, very mm, in tune with each other, as we had a perfect balance between units and heroes, seeing as I was the only one going hero, and everyone else was going units. But my, I wasn't just aiming for heroes, I was just aiming for generally for units. Kill as much units and just bail out. And begins the creeps. I think we're missing some guys. Yes, we're missing yellow and teal. Uh, in this game is five versus five, as I like five versus five since it was meant to be that way. Bring my footies. Well, mm, actually, it would have been better if we had dragged the creeps to the hill on top of the hill, cause these uh those sea elementals will have a chance to miss their attacks and then their bash will be less likely and my uh, hero is a little low on health right here I don't know why, how or why but my hero I think it was because of the two my hero's uh, HP just jumps like by like five, like 200 300 HP and We'll get killed right here, but we'll survive. And yeah, it's kind of weird. And right now, I I can't really see. I think it is 900, and I got two. Not like around 950. Almost 1k already. Okay. And as you you saw for a little bit there, uh, there was a grunt array. Almost all done with their creep before us. And, well, see, it's already a thousand, which is kind of weird. They also have a a healer, great healer. And here they come, trying to steal our stuff. And I think they do. Yeah, uh, that I can't see those words, but they do steal our stuff very well. Uh, kind of type something. I don't know why. Can't really read it from there. Uh, um. Yes. Uh. I believe. Uh, yes. I. I haven't watched my money again, as I always do. If I am on a roll, as you can see, my HP is already one thousand two hundred fifty. And I have very little health, so I decided to buy a mana, pendant of mana. So my mana goes jump to 830. Jack there. And I don't know why, but I think the tombs really, really help in the beginning, seeing as how Jack won't even reach HP of 1000 to like he's level 15, maybe? And then there's the Figneus, as it's called, I believe, in this version. 
and and then both sides has great healers. We have a potem, other known as Priestess of the Moon. Uh, now I kind of failed here because I thought Scar Light was justice, and justice does damage to any living or non-living non-living beings, and and stuns them for like a good amount of time. And in our team, we have a tech gen uh, Captain Tekra, I believe, is the big footman, kind of elvish footman there. And we're just kind of fall back for a second, not sending any footmen because that'll be just totally uh, feeding. And the term feeding means uh, just sending in units just to get killed really fast. With the and this that guy just fails right there, and I get the kill my footies I'm glad I left it behind like as before about feeding people don't upgrade their units which and mostly their enemies upgrade their units and it just becomes rape upgrade is a big difference and here I get a mountain king as they are going totally melee units and and I believe they have yes they have yeah, I think orange kind of sucked. I don't know. I don't think he upgraded anything of this stuff. Yes, he's just massively feeding. And again, tip to your noobs: just use common sense and just upgrade. And yes, I I decided to get Mountain King because Slam, in my opinion, isn't strong enough. And I'm going heroes anyways, so I need to kill a lot of units. So here I am, just getting the two area effect units, melee units. And I kind of like this build, because I made a lot of money. Check over here to see if, no, they didn't get the hydras yet. So watch out for that though, and these footmen just get raped for a second. And... Yes, like, in the beginning it's fine to use under-graded units. Scout right there. And I, my teammate, I think it's purple, yes, got Sky Fury. They had the Hydralis. And they are aiming for the top one, I believe. Or, they don't. I don't know. Yeah, yes, they did. And, I don't think I steal any the Hydralis kill. And you kill that health ward. That's just annoying. I have to, uh killed them already. And I, uh, yes, I did not kill these Hydras, sadly. I would have joyed. I would have been very happy if I could have killed him, but no. And, oh, actually I got that kill. Hmm. I thought I didn't. And, here we go. Mash up. Uh, little mash of killing here. I was going to get that Orb Frost, but my teammate got it before I did. Yeah, uh, my yeah, I couldn't have got it because my items were f completely full. And try a little kill these health wards because they make a big difference. Hmm, not bad. I have mostly of my footmen for footmen so left over. <laughs> and yes, I collected my skill points, which I should have upgraded as soon as possible. And this game would have lasted way longer if it weren't for uh, some people who just uh, who just left because it was just a bit of rape. It wasn't that much of a difference between us. But they just tried a little harder, I guess, or fixed some aspect of our strategies. It it could have been even, but they did not upgrade, which made them into a which created a big difference between the two of us. And, and I get the rip level 6 resurrection. Not really my favorite in this one. In this, uh. I think I'm gonna aim for that guy. I think I'm gonna kill him. Come on. Yes, I killed him. Mm, that was delicious. And. What was I talking about? Uh, sorry, uh, it's my first time commentary, comment having making a commentary, so I'm a little rough in the edges. 
And here I see the rabbit. I just noticed the rabbit. Before, I was like, they had a rabbit? Oh, I should kill that. Rabbits are very annoying as hell. But since I have Mountain, Mountain King and the slam kind of based attacks are just powerful against rabbits. Wabbits. Aha. Uh -huh. I'm going to shoot me some wabbits. And I, again, I will sound very retarded throughout the game. Okay, go there. Waste of mana, but it doesn't matter. And we'll see my uh, bandit or undead slayers, right? 1400 HP. Um, I kind of elected my Mountain King for a second there. I'll, in my opinion, I was pretty bad at this game. In this particular game, because I neglected certain parts where I shouldn't. Resurrection there, none of my units, that's why I do not like it. Oh yes, that was what I missed. Oh no, I stunned the wrong person. But he will die. I swear it. Ah, oh, he escapes, but he dies. Like, twice I believe in this game. And about Resurrection, like, I would have been happy about Resurrection if, uh, if, uh, it was my units. And green has illusions and... The one I'm running away is pretty obvious, and I was looking at the other Jack because, probably because uh, th the illusion does not do any damage, nor does it do any uh, cloak of emulation damage. And yes, Illidan, actually, Illidan is called Illidan in this game, but yes, uh, it's kind of tough to kill in this meta thing. And Teal is kind of after K here. Mm. Uh, and yeah, Blue is awesome. He has Priest and Sorceress. And greatest combo ever. As Sorceress will utterly rape people. And Torrents. As tor Slow, Polymorph, Sorceress are just stunning people. Like crazy. And then there's a Frost Worm, which is a bad idea for uh, melee people. For me, saying as how I have no way of hitting the air units without buying orb, which wastes a uh, slot. Purple here, just checking all my friends' uh, unit reserves, and I've noticed uh, we don't have any archers, which is which is amazing. Oh, actually, purple has a little bit, but not upgraded. But I tell him to upgrade him, and he does it. I think, but it does not matter because we're just doing incredibly. Without archers, which is a, uh, which is just pro, and then here I see the rabbit completely, completely, uh, unaware and stupid, stuns it, just double slam right there or thunderclap slam kills it, and I could have easily killed the uh, gray, but I just want to stay safe, do not want to get trapped, do not want to die. As I, I should have slammed when he was near me, and I should have. Uh, yes, that was kind of fail on my part, but I'm just concentrating on killing these units. Kind of like, oh, frost form. I should use scar light on that guy. As you can see, my uh, mountain king dies here. Stupid of me for not healing and then TPing. Really stupid mistake. Uh, if it weren't for the scarred worms. I mean, frost worms, I would have been fine. And, yes, uh, a little talk between my uh, teammates. You don't need to talk a lot, you just need to, you know, have some conversations now and then. Just make sure, you know, they're there actually uh, wanting to win or something. As a dragon, he joins a couple of my games. And, uh, he kind of lags sometimes, but it's all good. Uh, stretch there and yes, a uh, little um, waiting for lag. Uh, oh, and he drops out, which makes me sad. And but not bad actually. It's now even as one of their teammates left during the game. I believe it was the great healer that left. Ping there. 
amazingly amount of health. I believe he has 